Now we're taking it to the B section. The B section of the song starts out with a little bit different melody. But we have octaves again, starting at the octave on the fourth string. And then pick that with your pick, then go to the octave on the one fret higher and pick it and slide up two frets. Then do the thumb, come over to the eighth fret on the third string and then it's octave. Play that octave with your thumb, back down to the fourth string at the sixth fret octave, pick that and slide up two frets. Then we take it down to this G minor 7 chord. A little bit of a rhythm on that. Now that chord is basically your thumb at the 4th fret on the 6th string, 2nd finger at the 4th fret on the 4th, 3rd finger at the 4th fret on the 3rd, and then the pinky at the 4th fret on the 2nd, and then your 1st finger here at the 2nd fret on the 1st string. Just mute that fifth string out with the top of your uh, second finger. Then we climb up with this little octave thing, which is pick the first note, the sixth fret on the sixth fret, uh, sixth fret octave off the fifth string. Then the fourth fret, uh, fourth string, and its octave. Slide up, same string set on the sixth. Um, 6th fret, when you do that, slide it up 2 frets, and then back down, slightly back down to 8. So it goes 8, 9, eight, and back down to 8, without picking again. Okay, back to the chord, the G minor, 7. And then we have this little figure. That's kind of the same as we did before. It's just 8, 11, then the 9th fret on the 4th string, in its octave, slide up to the 11th fret, 8 octave on the 8, and then the slide from the 6th to the 8 on the 4th string, in its octave. Back down to the G sharp, minor 7. Then we have that same, um, pentatonic lick we have from before. The first one. Okay, then we have this final descending pattern that's going to take us out of this B section and back to the A section again. And it's basically going to be a little bit like that descending pattern we did first, but a little bit more, a little bit more involved with a little bit larger chords. Still the 11th with your thumb, and then do a bar across the 2nd and 3rd string. And uh, pick all three of those strings together. Then come down to 9 with your thumb, and do 9 on the 2nd string, and 10 on the 3rd here. Then shift that down 2 frets. And then do the same shape we did at the 11th fret, but at the 6th fret. We got, and then we end it with that same uh, chord we did earlier that we ended those uh, descending patterns with. All right, that whole B section. Okay, and that takes us back to the A section.